Welcome. You found 101 tips for interviewers and interrogators. I'm your host, Stan Walters, and this is tip lucky number 13. Tip number 13 for our series of 101 tips. Never use the tactic of suggesting the subject that they could have forgotten what they have done. You are saying, is it possible that you did it and you've forgotten this because you drink or because you use drugs? There is a, a significant empirical evidence. You can convince people that they have committed acts which they have not done. It's called memory distrust syndrome. Now, I know I'm going contrary to many other training programs and, and uh, courses teaching you that as a viable tactic. But let me tell you, the empirical evidence is going to overwhelm you and you could lose that case. You could lose that statement. So never suggest, could you have forgotten uh, could you have been drinking too much? You know how you are. Forget stuff. It's too trivial. What can happen is the person will doubt the memory and you can contaminate the statement. Then when you hear the information back, you're actually picking up an echo. You're thinking you're getting genuine information when in fact all that's happening is a person's repeating the information back to you that you suggested. So never use the tactic suggesting they could have forgotten uh, even though they may have done it. Please be sure to um, uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel here, The Lie Guy, uh, so you can get more of the 101 tips for interrogators. Connect on Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, uh, Twitter. Uh, I'd like to hear your comments below about memory issues, how you've dealt with subjects that have problems with memory in their interviews, and how you've tried to overcome that. Please share this with other folks and encourage them to sign up for the channel so they can participate and get all the 101 tips. See you back on the next one when we go through tip number 14.